Hey, what's going on, people? So I took some time. Oh, what's the matter, mate? You might have done a ah, It's a couple hours off work just to chill out, clean up. Because my day off tomorrow, so I thought I'd do it today rather than doing it all tomorrow because it bugged me. So going on a bit later on. Um, and look at Lil. Lil's back at it. Working out. Oh, mate. What's the matter? It's a hard life. It's a hard life, eh? Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Okay. Don't worry. We're here for you to stay. So what are you doing? I don't know, I need to, I just did a warm up, so I need to figure it out. I need to keep myself moving. So um, tomorrow, I'm off to central London to meet the cousin and good old mate Josh. I'm gonna go to one of the classes, a nice juicy session in. Looking forward to that. So I'm just making a nice um, peanut, peanut butter bagel. So I'm gonna prep that and then bedtime and early morning. Jump on the train. Why don't you look at the train times because they are on strike. So I probably have to take the underground. Oh, I forgot to mention as well. Look what the little maids. You know about these classics, huh? The classic school cakes. I don't know why the, the icing's like melted. I think it's oh, just been so under the light. Juicy. Mm. It is a low calorie mm -hmm. school cake. It's 115 calories a slice. They're quite small, but I think they're supposed to be thinner. Yeah. But I didn't have a tray um, like long enough. So they are a little bit deep, but that's okay. They're really tasty. Good. I'm looking forward to them. Well, I've had one already, but I'll take them to the gym as well. minute people I'm in Hanslow and I'm trying to find parking. Parking is an absolute nightmare. Just in London in general really I'm trying to find parking. Well free parking. It's not really any places to park so um yeah it looks like I'm paying paying for the parking. I looked online to try and find some but I can't find any close by. I'm miserable as well, so. Man of the hour. Yeah. Who's here? Ready? <laughs> Ready to go. <laughs> uh, let's go.
<laughs> Whipping up a shake. Whip, whip. So just finished our little session. Good old little session. How'd you find that all right? Man, it was tough. <laughs> yeah, it was a juicy sesh. But well, appreciate it, Lloyd. Thank you for very much for letting mm. us come along. Give yeah, us a little shake as well. So back in the car. I'm not gonna lie to you, I was falling asleep on that tube. My head was going all over. I was like, ah. but um, yeah, I'm off. Back in the car, gonna head home now and spend some time with Lil and my little son. <laughs> yeah. What's going on, peeps? I'm back home. Back home. Nice little stroll. I'm showing Lil um, the new apartments what are going up. I like to be a bit nosy, some new apartments. <laughs> I'd love to live down here and I'll show you guys where it is, but unfortunately it's well out of our budget. Too expensive. So we'll show you. We'll show you. There it is, you've got the woods on that side. And then you've got the actual construction site over here. But yeah, this is the road you'll be driving down to get to the estate itself. And then you've got a little golfing facility over there as well, which is nice. <laughs> My little starfish! <laughs> oh, what's that tuna? Mm. <coughs> Guys, get away! When does it smell it? See, you like tuna? No, he clearly won't. He definitely doesn't. You don't like it? Look at no. It. Nice shape up there. Yeah, and you're touching Tuna everything. Fingers. Can you um, <coughs> so I'm on hold at the moment to HMRC. So I've got my pay slip in and I've realised I'm getting emergency taxed. Or well, Lil won't realise I am. So I'm waiting out to get in contact with them so I can sort that out. But in the meantime, I hope I don't get copyrighted for that bloody music. Um yeah, it might be. <laughs> Uh, I'm just making my, my lunch for, for tomorrow. For tomorrow. <gasps> He's literally just done the biggest poo and then threw up all down himself. So I had to change him. And it's a bit cold, so I've just put him in his little starfish wrap. Oh, hello, baby. Do you like this hello. tune? You got any dance moves you want to show me? You still have tuna hands. Why haven't you watched them? <laughs> I watch them now. <laughs> Would you like some fruits? Hmm? Do you want some yogurt? You want some yogurt? Do you want some grapes? grapes? <laughs> What's some peaches? Like peaches. <laughs> you want peaches? You want peaches? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm giving the crates a good old clean up because they are filthy. So let's do that. Good old Ricky out here. He's chilling out here one. Cleaning in here. Dumb Rexes as much as I could. Unfortunately, when I let him off the lead, there's a little puddle in there. Well, it's not wet no more. I've dried him off. He's in there. And now I'm gonna do good old Ricks.
I've seen it organised. It's all in there because look at that. There's clutter everywhere. I've got these towels in there what I need to organise, what I need to wash them as well. Oh man. Boom, nice and clean. Two bags. I've got all the tennis balls they have found since starting this job in there. As they always find out I've never bought one. Spare dog bowls at the back. So this drawer's done. Got to fold up the towels in this one. And then we have completed it. So, so, so shift is nearly finished. It was a nice and easy one to be fair. Um, it was a static shift, so I didn't have to go anywhere, respond to any calls. I don't mind these shifts. It's, it's nice to mix up here and there once in a while, especially when it's nice and quiet like this, just to take the dogs out, do a bit of training with them. Um, but yeah, I literally finished in within half an hour, waiting for my man to relieve me, and I shall be off. I said to Lil, because Lil's at her in-laws, well, Lil's at her mum's, and I said to her, um, why don't you stay there? and I shall meet you there because I'm close by and then we'll spend some time there, have some dinner and then head home. So I finished at 7 o'clock and it's coming to that time soon and I cannot wait. Hey peeps, um, apologies I didn't even get an opportunity to film at the in-laws. Um, I had some nice dinner though. Well, I started kicking off at the end so we made our way home. Just prepping these bottle now before we go to sleep. And then tomorrow's a new day, so we go again. So I'm pretty knackered now, so I'm gonna just prep his bottle now. Lil's um, doing a bath for him. And then I shall see you guys tomorrow. Right, adios. Good morning. Good morning, peeps. Just fed the big man, he's chilling out. I'm just cleaning up now. Cleaning up. I woke up a bit later today. Um, I forgot to set my alarm. I'm just that tired, I forgot to set my alarm. I normally wake up about five. Uh, I woke up about six today. Took the dogs out, got back in about seven, and I fed them then. Normally I'm already good to go, ready to feed them around six. But well, you know what, he was a good boy today. A very good boy. Didn't complain one little bit, so. Yeah, fed them a bit later today. Just finished my run, got a couple miles in this morning. And guess who's awake? Hey! Morning. Good morning. Morning. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> I have your dirty clothes. Yeah, sorry, excuse me, Pete, just gotta take off my clothes. So, are you getting your nappy changed? Huh? Is your nappy getting changed? Yeah? Okay. What does your bib say? I love my mummy with all my heart. Yeah. Yes, you do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you want to take the camera and vlog? Here you go. Here you go. Hi, Dad, Dad. Hi, Mama. There you go. So, um, plan of action today is a big day for Rylan. Isn't it? He's yes. got his um, head skiing head today. Look about it before, he had C um, cysts. Now he's got a CT scan today to see whether or not. Well, not, not CT scan, is it ultrasound? Ultrasound. Yeah, so he's got an ultrasound scan today to see whether or not the uh, cyst is still there. Um, if they still de remain the same size. Oh. Oh. He doesn't want to be bad, sorry. <laughs> um, still remain the same size, or they've got bigger, or they've pretty much gone. Yeah, so. I, I sh yeah. we'll just have to wait and see how wait the appointment see. goes. Mm -hmm. And we will update you guys yes. when we're done. Box box packed in here, so I'm not taking two trips up and down.
Hello, hello. So I've just finished taking the dogs out uh, prior to work, but I'm now gonna go meet Lil at the hospital and it's time for Ryland's head scan. So let's go. Home sweet home. Home sweet home. Yay, daddy's home. Oh. Ryden is the most dramatic child. Yes. You literally pull the bottle away from his mouth and he will scream and cry and make yes. a fuss until that bottle is back in his mouth. Yes. <laughs> yes, he's a little dramatic baby he is. He definitely is. Um, so come on there because of he's to give you an update on his head scan. Oh yeah, his appointment today. Would you like to enlighten him? Yes. Yeah, so hey, I look all fresh from the shower. Um, so yeah, all overall all was well and good. And mm -hmm. um, they basically wanted to check his. Um, cysts in his brain and where he had a bleed on the brain because when he was born he had a grade I think it was a grade one hemorrhage yeah that's what's called um, and they also discovered that he had some cysts so he was tested for it for CMV which is some type of virus that I would have carried that he has got from me either when he was in me or soon got after when mm -hmm. he was born um, but he tested positive so <clears throat> kind of all links together they basically said that they don't see any significant changes since he was born from his original scans because he had them weekly in NICU um, however he doesn't know what kind of damage the bleed on the brain has done because it's basically caused this little cyst, these cysts that are sitting on his one of his ventricles of his brain on I can't remember if he said left or right 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 side of the brain yeah. um because you could see in the scan like his right ventricle was bigger, bigger than the other one so he said there has been some damage done but we don't know what that is and we won't know until he's he grows up much older yeah. Um, so we just have to keep an eye out on it. I mean, he might not even have anything because he said it's very, very common for premature babies to have bleeds on the brain. Um, but yeah, they, they were, they, he didn't seem concerned. He was happy with um, Ryland's scan. Um, and yeah, that's it really. It went well. I asked about the size of his head because obviously he's got a really big head. <laughs> <laughs> um, and obviously that was why he was pulled in for the first place for the scan was to make sure that his brain wasn't swelling. Um, but he said everything looks fine. It's just that his head, his skull and his brain are growing twice as much now. Um, so no cause for concern. So it's fine. Mm -hmm. We don't have anything to worry about, but we'll always keep an eye on it because we know that's, since he was born, that's always been there. Um, like concern. Yes, yeah, yeah. Was his head yes. with the cysts and stuff and CMV, so. Oh, all looks well for him. Yes. All good. Which is good news, so good thank goodness. Hood. Right, and to that end, peeps, we are going to end the vlog there. We hope you enjoyed this week's vlog. Oh. And don't. <laughs> Oi! Good <laughs> lad! <laughs> and don't forget to like and subscribe, and we will see you on next week's video. See you later. Bye! Bye.